Hello, YouTube! I'm Jake from Peyton B and their friend, and today we have a Walmart haul. Oh boy. So, um, um, I don't know, let's just, also this is very heavy, so we're just gonna have to scoot the unboxing basket to the side real quick. And now let's take a look. Here's our most heaviest thing. A, um, let's see here. Oh, yeah. Tripod with smartphone cradle. Now, you guys might be thinking, like, um, what the heck, Jake? You already have a tripod. It, um, yes. Yes, I do, but, um, this was, um, yeah, $14, save four whole dollars, um, yeah, so, um, as you guys might know, um, recently, I've been very unhappy with this tripod here because it falls over a lot. So, um, yeah, let's get this thing open. Um, I don't know why this is reduced price. I'm not sure if I want to know, though. I probably don't. <laughs> oh, this open here. This even comes with a bag. Why didn't mine come with a bag? Hmm. The current one that I'm using right now, it came from Amazon because we needed one that could um, become very tall. But um, now that there is no need for that, uh, for, um, reasons. That means I can get my own tripod for solely my own YouTube needs. Well, let's get this out of this bag here. Um. Alright. The mine didn't come with an instruction manual. Um. And again, who needs an instruction manual for this? Okay. I have a feeling this is probably reduced because somebody returned it by possibly. Um but that's um that's okay by me. Um I'm fine with used stuff. Um so let's see what we have cooking here. Um, okay, what the heck those? Oh, okay. Um, don't know what I just did. Okay, so I um yes, yeah, so this one goes like this. And, um, not too sure about the thing that I'm looking at right now. Um, don't like this here. Um, can I undo this? Yes, I can. Um, yeah, I don't think you guys want to watch me sit through, um, 
uh, I'm gonna try to figure this out. Um, yeah, maybe I don't like this one very much. But we'll test that later. Um, ouch. Just put that down before I get, whoops, um, angry at it. Okay, next, we have a movie. Actually, this is two movies in one. Okay, so we got The Little Mermaid 2, Return to the Sea, and we got The Little Mermaid, Ariel's Beginning. Now, if you've not watched either one of these movies, you should, because, um, unpopular personal opinion time, um, I like both of them better than the first one. Ha ha ha. Uh, I sure Peyton B would probably uh, disagree with me, though. Peyton B really likes the first one. The heck is this? Um, yeah, but also, Peyton B does also like these two movies, too. I'm just not totally a big fan of the first one, really. Um... I don't think you guys clicked on this video either to, um, have my personal opinion on, um, Disney movies, but, <laughs> this is what you get <laughs> whenever you click on a Peyton B and their friend video, you get, um, Disturbed. Like the band. Okay, so, um. Um. Whoa, okay, we have a digital code in here. Um. Actually, you know what, y'all? Here you go. Here's the code. Now, joke's on you. By the time that I post this, I'll have probably already redeemed this. And if I hadn't, then, um, I guess whichever one of you idiots decides to try the code gets it. Um, okay. I did not buy this for the code, though. You know, I'm obviously not. Because this is a physical movie. And in this household, we buy physical movies. Because we want to see them physically. So, um, yeah, I will take these out later, but, um, as you can see, we got that Blu-ray, and, actually, hold on, I need to, okay, let's, let's see here, um, I think they have this double stacked, Ew, that, Oh god, that's nasty. Um, okay. Mmm. Let me be very careful with these. Um. Are these stuck together? Hold. Wait. Okay, um. All right, they were actually a little bit stuck, which that's that's not a good sign. All right, so here's the DVD. Um, which that's what we're gonna be testing today, cause um, even though I do have a Blu-ray, um, my portable DVD player is not um, it it cannot play Blu-rays. Um, and this is also not closing either. That's. This is what happens whenever you do Walmart hauls, guys. Um. Okay. Next. Stainless steels, reusable straws. I've been wanting reusable straws for a really, 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 really long time now. So, um, if I'm, if I, if I'm disappointed by these, then so goodness help me. Okay? 
Um, I already can't get it out of the packaging, and um, trust me, guys, my my patience is like to it, it is getting to here, okay? Because this tripod wasn't cooperating. The, um, the stupid movies were also making me mad. Um, if this makes me any more mad, then um, I don't know, guys. I can be a really loyal man, but oh goodness if you break my trust. Okay. Oh, they're gonna take the scissors to this. You know, this should really not be this complicated though, um, to just open this because I you know, I already paid for the product. Right? Right. Huh? So, I should be able to get it out of the packaging. Yes. 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 There. Okay. Alright, so now that we finally got that out, let's see if we have... First off, why are these stuck together like the discs were? That is gross. Alright, next we have one of these little doohickeys. I think that's for like, um... Oh yeah. Yeah, okay, that's that's enough of that. Um, so yeah, this is straws. You clang them together, they make funny sound. There's two more straws. And um, here is um, these things I... Kind of don't know what these are for, but, um, maybe they taste good? I don't know, let's see. Actually, wait. Probably should wash this stuff before putting it in my mouth. Yes, that sounds like a splendid idea. Alright, and lastly, for our unboxing portion of this video, before the, um, product testing... We have, um, Sangria. Um, I got two because, um, um, why did I get two? Oh, yeah, because, um, okay, if there's four partners in this relationship, right, um, um, let's see, um, me and um me and Ray we can have this bottle just split it in half okay and then hit B and Caesar they can split this bottle in half and then everyone has some sangria who that makes a funny clang sound too but I better not do that again, or else the bottles might bust open. They might bust open if I do that, too, so I better not do that. Um, okay, well, that will BRB, because product testing awaits. All right, everyone. And we're back. I washed the straws. I opened up that bottle there. 
And also, you guys haven't noticed the change of view here. I'm um, using the new tripod, which it is much sturdier than the previous one, but there is also quite a few things that I do not like about this one. So, we'll just have to see which one I end up using more. Um, not too sure yet. But, <laughs> anyway, um, I guess let's, um, test out these two discs here. Um, first we'll test out, um, the Little Mermaid 2, which we will open that up. <laughs> um, get the disc out of here. Um, All right, so here is the disc, um, very boring looking. Boo! Let's get this thing on. Did make sure to charge it beforehand. All right, okay, so you need to turn the volume down. I'm gonna just turn it down to zero for um copyright reasons. I don't want Disney to like freaking copyright strike me or something. Now first off, what is up with this goofy uh ratio right here? Why do I got like black bars uh, like up here and up here? Like dude, how wide of a widescreen do we need? Actually, no, hold up. I'm, I'm checking the ratio here. Oh, sorry guys. Um, okay, so, yeah, Disney DVD fast play. Now I want to go to the main menu, please. I'll film and Promotions may not be available in all territories. It's crazy how I don't care. You know, at least I don't have to sit through ads on this one. Because, um, there was a... I bought The Hunchback of Notre Dame on um, DVD a while back. <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't unbox it for y'all, but, um... Yeah, like, bro, it made me sit through ads. Okay, and that, you know, that stuff really made me mad. Also, I just realized, y'all, I forgot to turn the lights on in my room. Let me go do that real quick. There you go. I don't know if y'all can tell the difference, but, um... Yeah, let's look at the aspect ratio here. Okay, um... Is it? Um. Bro, I'm sorry, y'all. Um, we got the five point one audio, but like, um, yeah, this just says like widescreen, like, bro. See, and if you look at this, now the bars are gone. So it's only the intro that was in, like, that super widescreen, like, goofy stuff. Like, bro, give me a break. <laughs> like, okay, where's my remote? <laughs> There's the remote. Sorry, y'all, I'm not organized today. Okay, here's the remote. We shall navigate this menu. Alright, so for the bonus features, let's see what we got here. As storybook. Deleted song. Got a short. That's some pretty good stuff. 
You know, nowadays they don't even include darn bonus features. I don't know, y'all. Spoilers. We're about to look at the scene selection. Yeah, but this is the layout of the menu. Um, I'll turn the music on real quick. Take a look at the setup real quick, too. Just me, or is it really slow at like loading stuff up? Sorry if that's a weird observation, it's just like register your DVD, bro. Sorry, but like. You know, even though in this household we are DVD collectors, we have literally never registered a DVD. Return to film. Hey, yo, hold up. No, we don't. No, we're not showing the whole film here. Okay, um... Sorry. Um, well, yeah, there was that. The I don't know, y'all. That did y'all also notice like a video quality? Not the, no, not just more so like the picture quality on the um like menu was just really bad. Like, bro. You could literally freaking, like, count the pixels. I know, y'all. Sorry, this ain't a movie review. Um, we just look at the menus here. Uh, Alright, it is loading. DVD video. Yes. Can y'all hear noises things making? Okay, y'all, well... This one... Is, is this an ad? Turn it on real quick. Movies! Yes, this, this is movies. Magic! No, this is not magic. This is technology. Yeah. More! No, I don't want any more. Well, I guess that was just an intro. Maybe? Available on DVD and Blu-ray. I don't care. I'm not gonna pause to read that crap. No. No, no, no. I do not want fast play. I want to go to the main menu. I've literally never used a fast play, bro, because I, I just want to go to the menu. Oh, this ain't copyright. See, at least for this, like... Yeah, I don't know. This looks slightly nicer quality. How do they fumble that one, bro? Okay. Oh, we got scene selection first here. See, I don't know. This just looks nicer, though. You know, it's like somebody actually tried almost. Okay, let's look at the bonus features. Now, I'm pretty sure the Blu ray has different bonus features and it probably also has a different menu because i don't 
know if I showed you guys, but it has both movies on there because Blu-rays can fit more data on them. But <laughs> because this can't do Blu-ray, I um, sadly can't show you guys because the only Blu-ray that we have in this house is in the living room and in my mom's room. So, um, yeah. So let's see, we got deleted scenes, music and more, games and activities. Oh, I guess if you actually... Okay, so if you actually click on the stuff, then you can see it. So I think this also might have more bonus features on it. I oh, miss whenever I had the games on DVDs, bro. Okay, main menu. Set up. You register your DVD. I don't want to register my DVD. Oh, I got it. honestly, guys. Um, then again, this is probably an older release that's just repackaged. But uh, you know, one thing that kind of annoys me though is whenever they only have an option for English with the closed captions, because I feel like they should also have an option for English without closed captions. Which would just be regular subtitles. Which there is a different guy. There's a difference, okay? Just look it up. But, um, and again, slight nitpick. But I just thought that'd be worth noting. Sneak peeks. Yeah, see, this is where they just, like, advertise stuff, bro. Special edition? What? Heck is the special edition? Um. Yo, know, this is kind of confusing. Here, let's see what they got in more. So, um. Yeah, that was a little confusing, but, um, there you go, that was the two DVDs, um, and turn that off, and then, hey, right, come on, quit spinning. Okay, there we go. But, um, do I recommend this? Um, I don't know. Depends how bad you want it. I think I only paid $10 for this. I mean, it doesn't matter too much because, I mean, $10 for two movies, Blu ray, DVD, plus digital code, you know, um, so guys, if you haven't noticed this sticker here, um, yeah, sticker, um, I mean, let's see, will the case finally close? Okay, well, it just took way too much force and effort to do so. So for some reason this says Disney Movie Club exclusive. I I don't really understand that. Um, but there's a lot of things in this world I don't understand. Last but not least, let's try our drink. 
I put the straw in here too, since I thought, you know, straw, might as well put it in. Um, well, um, oh yeah, guys, this is non alcoholic for anyone concerned. Um, I don't drink, it's not something I like to do. Um, but if you are a drinker, um, Drink responsibly and don't drive. Let's give this a try. Uh, uh. All right. Well, um, it's sangria. I don't know, honestly, I can't really taste that much. But also, this is a little flat. <laughs> that could be my fault, though, because, um, it did kind of take me a while to, um, you know, actually get to drinking it, as you guys seen it just sitting there. Yeah, it's completely open. But, um, yeah, this is the straw. I put the little thing on it, because I thought might as well. I guess you could technically do it without the thing. If you're a bit of a masochist, which, um... Hmm. I don't know, I mean... I'm more of, um... I'm much more sadistic, but I'm, uh... I mean, it is nice and chewy. But, um... No, I'm occasionally a masochist. <laughs> occasionally. Let's give it a drink here without, um, the tip. I kind of actually tasted different. Then again, I can't taste. The only thing that I was actually tasting was um the texture of the straw and the temperature and the temperature of the drink and how flat it is. But guys, this will be the end of the video. Um, if you like this video, give us a like, give us a subscriber, and comment down below if, um, you are also disappointed when you buy stuff at Walmart, because most of the time, I sure am, and, um, yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.